Once again, the scourge of domestic violence has raised its ugly head. This time, the life of a precious woman has been lost. However of concern to women in action is the common factor of abuse of women and children physically, emotionally, and mentally. Let me plead and empathize with the family and friends that not only does it take a village to raise a child, but it takes a village to ensure that most vulnerable among us, meaning our women and children, are kept safe and feel safe. Let us not be reactive, but rather proactive. Let's not just talk amongst ourselves about what we see going on, but do something about what's going on. Women, let us believe in the strength of the sisterhood. Let's be our sister's keeper. Let us report to the relevant authorities any areas of concern that we may have when we notice it. The death of young Sophiana Edwards should have never happened. We have all failed her and continue to fail our fellow women when we do nothing. We fail our mothers when we do nothing. We fail our sisters when we do nothing. We fail our aunties and friends, not forgetting our daughters when we do and say nothing. Let us make this the last such incident in Sweet Helen. Let's all vouch to play our part to end violence against our women and girls. As we get set to celebrate International Women's Day, I am saddened by the death of Sophiana Edwards and of all those women who have been abused, killed, and violated. We need to be bold for change. Be bold to report. Be bold to say no. Be bold to say enough is enough. Be bold to leave an abusive relationship. Be bold to stand up for your rights. Women have never had the potential to be the drivers, to be the drivers of change as we do today. Through history, women have been fighting for our rights to be viewed as equal, to have control over our decisions affecting our bodies, for equal pay and overall equally respected. However, women today are joining in record numbers demanding change. Women of all races, ages, religious beliefs, economic status are uniting to drive change. The time to speak up and join together is now. We can't be silent on issues that affect our and our children's future. Go to a meeting, go to a march, talk to each other ask questions, and call our government representatives. We have a government who is willing and will be with us. Be hard, our voices are strong and our numbers are large. We have the power to drive change as never before. Be bold for change. Today, I stand like Malela who said, I raise up my voice, not so I can shout, but so those, that, those without a voice can be heard. We cannot succeed when half of us are held back. I and Women in Action stand in solidarity with all our women of St. Lucia and the world. Happy International Women's Day. Be bold for change.